Hello all, it's your commissioner here. Don't mind the outfit or the fact that my mutton chops or mustache may fall off. I've already lost one even before we get started here. But uh, we're here with the week three recap of the Misfit Toys Fantasy Football League. On the scoreboard this week, Brady Gaga. Yours truly took down the German juggernaut that is Leanne Oldenberger, 195 to 165, 195.7 points, best of the week. Thank you very much. Leanne did have the highest score of the week. Patrick Mahomes almost got 60 by himself. Guy's fantastic. In the closest game of the week, hooked on a Thielen, Elliot Glenn took down Jazzy Sports Balls. Nick Ozzie Oswald, 145 to 139. Tight matchup. Elliot just had Travis Kelsey going last night to put him over the top. In the biggest blowout of the week, it was Team Dak Streets Pack. Amanda Anderson taking down Team X Dean Christine, 173 to 104, 69 point differential, and Amanda moved to three and O. Oh, she's on fire. Angie Lutnegger, 162. Team Cotter, 100. Unfortunately for uh, TC, 100 points was the lowest of the week, and gets even lower so far. Thomas is 0 and 3 to start the season. Uh, but head out, Thomas. A lot, of, a lot of season to go. Anything can happen here, all right? Playoffs are open to everybody, so just get hot at the right time. Last-minute lineup, Brad Edmondson moved to 3-0, 165 winner over Team Tealy Time, 128. Um, I guess his Tealy Time was uh, preparing his costumes for the next couple weeks and didn't really focus on his football lineup. And the last matchup of the night was uh, Fail Mary, 183, beating Team Wee, 141. Uh, Lisa moves to three and zero as well. The standings in the East haven't come up with a better name yet. Maybe you guys can help me out. You got uh, Amanda leading the way three and zero. Elliot two and one, and a log jam at the bottom. Leanne, me, Christine, and Ozzy all one and two. That log jam will get broken up this week as we all play each other though. In the West, you got two kingpins. Lisa Dow, Brad Edmondson both three and zero, and then you got the counselors one and two. Nicole Wee. And Angie Lutenegger, Teeley hanging in there at 1 and 2. And Thomas bringing up the rear right now at 0 and 3. This week's matchups as we look ahead, there are some good ones on the, on the docket. Brady Gaga, 1 and 2. Team Christine, 1 and 2. Right now I'm favored by 0.1 points in that matchup. So that should be a fun one. Another close one, 1 and 2. Jazzy Sports Balls, 1 and 2. Team Jugger, German Juggernaut. Uh, Jazzy Sports Ball is favored by .7. So another tight one there at the bottom of the Eastern Conference, Eastern Division, whatever you want to call it. For first place in the East Division, Elliot trying to knock off Amanda. Uh, Amanda is favored by a point and a half right now. We'll see that happens up if Russell Wilson can keep her on top or not. In the West, Team Tealy Time and Angie Lutenegger. A lot of bad blood between those two. I'm sure that will be a uh, fierce rivalry as we go forward. Uh, but Tealy right now favored by 12 points. And Thomas Cotter, he's favored by 15 over Nicole Wee. We're rooting for you, Tom. Let's get win number one, buddy. And in the matchup of the week, you got Fail Mary 3-0, last minute lineup 3-0, Lisa versus Brad. Right now, Lisa favored by 34 points, uh, but I'm sure Brad will hold true to his name with his last minute lineup and get a winner in there. He does need a quarterback, though. Jimmy G, out. Mitch Trubisky, out. So who are you going to pick up, Brad? You need to find somebody to carry you to that 4-0. Those are the matchups this week. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video. This is take about 70, because uh, either my mustache has fallen off, the bells rang, the fire bell rang, or I just it made a fool of myself, which I always do anyways. But I uh, hope you guys enjoy these videos, and uh, we'll keep pumping them out, keep setting those lineups. Glad you guys are involved, and uh, let's go Brady Gaga.